You said part of your website you try not to uh, publish slanderous or libelous comments. Is that correct? Right, but I've definitely failed. You know, I've definitely yeah. things have gotten in that I wish hadn't on, on, on all sides of these issues. But. And that would include, you know, making claims towards individuals or organizations. You mean if, uh, like when you felt bad in a commentary when we called you guys a bunch of racists? Yeah. Yeah, that would be that would be different. Yeah, so you so you so you published yeah. that without any. Oh, we didn't say bunch of racists. Yeah, that's how you characterized it on your website. Yeah. yeah. Well, did you, well, was, did you not publish a video immediately after you left this freedom of information hearing, calling our organization anti-immigrant racist and claiming that we would hunt illegal aliens down? Is that what I said? I at the, at, yes, sir. At the end of the week, once every couple of weeks, we do a video opinion article, mm -hmm. like one out of every fifty or hundred articles. And in it, I had talked about being at the hearing. I don't remember saying, what did you say about racist? I don't remember calling you racist. Did you call us anti-immigrant? Definitely. Yeah. Did you because I, I, I had a basis that we talked about the way you talked about the Manuel Santiago murder. Did you, did you compare us to the White Citizens Network in down south? No, I compared you to the White Citizens Council. Down south. Yeah. Right. You know, so that's a different group. Would you say that you made these claims with really no evidence? Uh, no, with a lot of evidence, which is the way you characterized the murder of Manuel Santiago, which I thought was such a deeply racist characterization, given the basis was a, a guy who was convicted of a violent crime saying, I didn't do it. Mm -hmm. You used that as saying, look, that's proof that this guy wasn't the victim of a crime because he's an immigrant. Mm -hmm. Whereas you're a law and order group that in any other situation you would not use the testimony of a convicted violent criminal trying to plead for less time in jail as the sole basis for discrediting the account of police. Mm -hmm. So that was the comment I was making in an opinion article. Have I sent you emails on several occasions in your uh, area as being a reporter asking you not to say that we're anti-immigrant in articles and to read our website that we're not anti-immigrant? Yes, and I have read it, and you've asked us to characterize the group as opponents of illegal immigration as opposed to immigrants altogether. Mm -hmm. And in our news stories, we have adopted that policy at your request because I thought that was a fair request. Mm -hmm. Except for the video that you... Well, that was a op clearly opinion article. Okay. Thank you. No further questions.